All right, so that I can't seem to find anything there. More stuff out in the military area. This could be like underneath the map, like movies down in the water. Yeah, it is. This, I can't jump over this, can I? Before we do the military district and advance the main plot, let's um. Another name go. I ain't slacking off or anything. The mech on attacks from the air, right? I'll keep in watch. I'm only joking. Where am I? <laughs> Where am I? Hi that. Chewy radish. Ah. Hello. I'm realizing now that I didn't check to see if there were like monsters out in this water. I just saw shinies, so I went for it. We seem pretty fast. Especially considering we don't seem to really be using our arms much. He's one hand. We are booking it through this water though. Alright. Those are Rainbow Zirconia. White beetle, fairy dragonfly, another white beetle. Huh. Let's, let's just get the items that are down here for now. Complete. Rainbows of Kernia taken care of. I think, we, I think we're gonna need one of those. Oh, Sweet Wasabi too. Or the um, Collectivedia too. Items everywhere. It was her clean, yeah. the feeling that the continue a while to like advance through a new area and we get to them and then like the actual story will go a lot faster than trying to do all the side stuff. But we've wandered pretty far from where we started at so I don't know how strong the monsters are going to be over here so you might want to avoid them. They were putting you know handy little colored icons above the monsters heads which will help but we also got to keep in mind that we only have one party member right now. Another dance apple. Even without the side stuff as long? Yeah, well, I'm definitely doing the side stuff. I, I don't Oh, yeah, okay, look at these. They've got like a red icon with like a border around it. I'm guessing we don't want to go anywhere near those yet. We'll get those blue items later. <laughs> did that respawn or did I miss that? These blue items might just respawn in infinitely. Ooh, potato. Also, we can teleport, right? Is that another quest in the residential district at night? 
It's like a quest turn in, like a, a completion, though, not like a pickup, right? Punch in a tree. Oh, this guy. Okay, cool. What's up? Do you need to see me for something? Those grandma's biscuits? She really shouldn't have gone to all the trouble. Thanks for bringing them to her. Please thank grandma for me as well. Hello. Perforated ore. Okay. One thing you love about this game is the character personalities. I'm not really far enough in to see that, but what I've seen so far seems good. Okay, we get some more quests over in the commercial district now too. And we still gotta go do all those like monster killing ones and stuff. Which I like that it seems to show you like a good place to go find the monster. I like that it shows you where the quests are on the map too because especially considering that we're having to go back to areas we've already walked over if it didn't give me a hint to go back there I would definitely miss a lot of quests the options for how to play each individual character is great so do you switch characters just by changing who's in the leader slot, I guess? You can't do it like on the fly, I don't think. Right? Desiree. <laughs> That's my wife's name. <laughs> Hello. Oh, sure. There you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. I've broken my watch. Look, it's in pieces. I'm terrible at machines, even little ones like this. Do you mind fixing it for me? You don't have to be good with machines to be careful with them. You just have to be careful. Wasn't your father good with machines? I'd have thought fixing things would be the first thing he'd teach you. Not just good, he was amazing. When I was little, I used to marvel at how he swung that hammer. But he's gone now, and as hard as I try, I can't be like he was. I'm sorry, Desiree. I didn't mean to be rude. Oh, it's easy to make you go all timid. Seriously, don't worry about it. It's been a year since then. I'm back on my feet. Anyway, are you going to fix my watch or not? Alright. I have to mend it in my lab. Fair enough. Brilliant. I'll leave it in your capable hands. It's in pretty bad shape. I have to use the equipment in the lab, so it might take a while. Alright. How's it going? More named people. Me and this place, we don't suit each other. And the other residents have become complacent and lazy. I feel like my frontier spirit is being crushed by this place. How's it going? Yeah, I saw you can only fill three people at a time. It looks like there was also four reserve slots and a space for guest party members too, though. So that's exciting. Twenty cuffs. Okay. I love that you get like random equipment from monster drops too. So like when I'm out questing or leveling or whatever, I can just get like random really good drops. That's awesome. Hello. Let's do it. Item Desiree trades. Only bottoms. I kind of like. <laughs> it's kind of crazy, but like, oh, look at this. Oh, it's Miller again. Uh -oh. I'm getting bored of skipping off, but I'm just so fed up working for Captain Leader. Um, I had different things to say at different times of the day. It's awesome. Uh, I was gonna say that, like, the fact that they added transmog to the game makes me want to get one of each type of armor so that I have all the transmog options. King Squeeze. What's up? Don't know what you think you're talking to me will achieve. I'm just your everyday commoner guard, commoner 
garden moneylender. You want to be more precise? Alright then, I'm the creditor for a certain good-for-nothing critic. One who's overdue on his payments. What's up? What's up? Trade with me. Redness boots. Well, those are nice. Those are really nice. Here, you want a cool potato? Cool. I'm gonna get a few more trade. So that's really easy to do the trading. I don't know why the potato is worth so much, but I'll take it. Look at that. Ten more physical defense. I mean, that literally goes from seven to seventeen. That's a huge upgrade. I love that you can actually see what equipment you're wearing too. That's awesome. Who's this? I think I'm making some kind of trap. For catching in I'm thinking of making some kind of trap for catching insects. I just don't have the time and all the materials I need. Can you help a guy out? Plate snow. I already have some of that. Thanks, I can't wait to start building it. Awesome, awesome. Alright, do we have any more quests? We have one over here. And then before we head into the military area and trigger the next main quest thing. I think we're going to come get these ones for killing animals. So there's a quest over here. I don't know what this symbol is. Let me see. Um, legend. Map entrance or exit. Okay. Probably don't want to go to that. This is where we started. Dunban's house. Wait. Dunban's over here? This house was Dunban's house? Okay. We went there, I don't think we could get in. Man, it'd be really easy, like, cause the people are constantly moving around. It's really hard to like, know if you've met everyone or talked to everyone. And especially since like, people are getting like, added to like an affinity chart over here, right? Like I'd really like to get everyone added to it. Look at all this. What is this? Okay, a regular, a regular. Kind friend. Rivals. Like we're seeing like relationships between them. Look at all of this. And it's just starting. That's gonna grow, I can tell. All right. Hi there. I want to make some kid-sized armor for my son. Problem is, I don't have enough small scales. Might help me out? Okay. Awesome, awesome. Piranha axes. Piranhas? Like, so fish? So maybe they're in the water? Oh, it's not too much trouble. Oh, we can see our requests here, too. Even completed ones. All right, so that's all the quests available right now. Let's come out here and see about some of these easy monster kills, maybe. And then we should probably advance the story to get more party members, yeah? That's probably gonna be the next move. So this is Dumban's house here? Yeah, it sure is. Huh. Yeah, these blue things definitely respawn. Okay. Oh, it shows you which ones are for the quest. That's awesome. I'm oh, sure we got a new ability too. What was it? Stream Edge. And puts break on enemies in front. Whoa. Let's go! Level up. Level seven already. Filthy wing. Alright, rabbit diode. Don't know. Do we have a reason to kill a little bunnets on other than I just want to? Alright, I'm feeling it. Take this! Wah! Oh, it's looking pretty kind of cool. Treasure chests. 
I like that they're like different types of treasure chests too, so you can like immediately see, oh man, I just got a rare drop or something. That's cool. Gotta see about all these blue ones over here. These enemies look like they're low. Wow. Level 4 is blue to us now. I don't think Break actually does anything other than make them susceptible to topple, which we can't do ourselves. We can definitely do this! Wasabi, the anti-air battery. What is this icon? Does the eye mean that he'll aggro if we walk near him, maybe? Oh, I think he does. Let's go! Split edge! Take this! Stream edge! We're probably gonna have to heal ourselves in this one. Alright, I'm feeling it. This isn't going well. Let's go. We don't heal very much. We can definitely do this. Come on, we can do it. Split edge. Oh, oh we can lose here. Flash, flash. Come on, Shulk. Right. Okay. I'm feeling it. Okay. <laughs> we need to get more party members, huh? Alright, so the eyeball means that they'll aggro. We learned that. That's a good thing to know. <laughs> Let's see how far they aggro from help. I can walk around them, right? Let's grab these blues. These guys are level 5 and 6. We need more party members. I also worry that, like, I'm leveling, but when I get, like, Ryan back, he's not going to be leveled, and then I'm going to be higher level than him, and then he'll have trouble holding aggro off of me. Oh, look at this guy, too. Oh, unique monster. The Verdant. Oh, then we have, a, we have a quest to kill him. Once again, probably would be better to come back with multiple people. I'm guessing. I'm going to grab this blue thing and run from him. Well, actually, it doesn't look like he aggroes. It's nice that it tells you whether the monster aggroes or not. Like grabbing all these blue items, see what we can get. Oop. Okay, flammies. Let's try one of these out. We can probably open up with the. Uh, the other attack. So I might be able to like lower their We can definitely do this. Might be able to lower their armor or something. This isn't going well. This guy hurts. Backslash! Almost the split edge! Yeah, I should run. No, I'm yeah, I died. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, is it gonna load an auto save or what happens when you die? Now we're about to learn that. If the leader is incapacitated, you'll return to the previous landmark. If the leader is, not the whole party, huh? Oh man, that's something to keep track of. That's it though, you just go back to the nearest landmark, you don't lose anything. That's awesome. Alright, let's continue with the story until we get our party members back. That'll make doing these quests a lot easier. Ooh, more named people. Hello. Doing better pretty well for myself. Better than the guy who goes down by the bridge every night. Is he learning how to argue or something? A bit silly. Hello. Bloody pelt. Yes? 
Wanna guess what my job is? You'll never guess. I'm a critic. No one else tells it like it is from the commoner's perspective. I don't make a lot of cash, but my work is good as gold. And you owe money, huh? I right, talk to your bookie. Yes? Or your... Um... <sighs> Lone Shark, or whatever it is. Money cuffs. Ether defense up, and a cool potato. Hello. Hello. You a big ether light right in the middle of the plaza? Well, I love that thing. There isn't any light prettier. If you think there's a prettier one out there, I'll see it for myself. Yeah. It's everywhere, man. It's awesome. Nighttime is very quiet. It's my favorite time of day. When it's daytime, kids are loud and noisy. They annoy me loads. So I like nighttime the best. The puns are kind of interesting. They got some character to them. I'm gonna get like a no pawn in the party. That's gotta happen, right? I'm assuming that happens. All right, let's jump over here. Though we wanna we wanna advance the story a little bit. All right. I need myself some. Party members. Discovering landmarks. Colony features landmarks, important places in hidden areas, and locations, places of interest. Find all the landmarks and locations in the area to open up the complete area map. What the hell are you playing at? Uh oh, the colonel's going to explode. Oh, Vanguard! Crashing the mobile artillery into a house. Man, that mustache. They've been hyping it up. And they were right. Sorry, sir. It's just that we were trying to go as fast as we could, like you ordered. But it's impossible to get back to the military district in only 40 seconds. I don't want any excuses. <laughs> Champions don't whine. They win. Yes, sir. You're a disgrace to the uniform. Are you forgetting the shame you brought on this force during joint maneuvers with Colony 6? Stick your back into it, maggots. Move it. Yes, sir. Get the artillery back to the military district, double time! Then I want a million press-ups from both of a you. A million? You better not stop until your biceps explode! Colonel, we can't move the artillery. What? You better give a damn good reason why. Sir, the impact of the crash damaged the ether conduction cable. The ether fuel proceeded to leak out, and now the cylinder is empty. Well, change the cylinder then. Can't you even <laughs> do something as simple as that? The auxiliary cylinders have all been used up. It'll be three days until more come in, sir. I told you to keep a stock of fuel in reserve. Sorry, sir. It is like You're nothing but so slackers. Extra. Oh. Same old colonel. At this rate, the men will all be dead before they see any action. <laughs> nope, I have a quest. What's up? What's up? You ever been to the pool below Outlook Park at night? There's a monster called Lake Magdalena that appears there. It'd mean a lot if you could eliminate it once and for all. It's only there at night, huh? Such courage. Take care and make sure you don't get hurt. Hello. Hello. I will collect the ether cylinders. Blah, 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 blah. I will collect the ether cylinders at once, Colonel. Hello. I'll be more careful next time, Colonel. Yes. Put your backs into it. Can I move on you maggots? 
You trade with the Colonel? I can't trade with the Colonel. He's named, he didn't show up on the Infinity chart either, did he? Come on. Oop, daytime. Okay, he's still the whole day night cycle thing. What do we have back here? Oh, hi. I'm only really happy when I'm free to talk like now. I'm fed up with taking care of these useless men all day long. That, what do you want? I'm only on my break. I don't know what to do. Monica's always slacking off. and never do that sort of thing. That Monica, where did she get to? Is it true she's been skipping work? So there's someone named Monica who skips out on work. We can find where she's hiding. Quest here. What's up? Some ridge antals have appeared outside the commercial district. Can you go and take care of them for me? Absolutely. Nice one. Get more than ridge antals around at night. It's not an easy job, but you should be able to handle it. Oh, he's got more too. He's like that other guy who just keeps giving out more What's quests. There are a lot of cute frogs in the beach. Yep. Okay. What's up? On Crabbles. Alright, that's it for him. So the guys that give out like monster kill quests, it looks like tend to have groups of quests. Oh, oh it's Emmy. We heard about her. Are you the interfering do-gooder everyone's been talking about? Got a big favor to ask you. Could you find Miller for me? I've seen him. Since you got a problem. He's an habitual slacker and I just don't know what to do with him. He always runs away as soon as he sees me coming. I haven't so much as spoken a word with him lately. He's the only subordinate I have, so I can't just ignore him. I'll be sure to reward you when you find him. No problem, Good to me. Oh, 